Hi, and welcome to this Kineractive demonstration. Today, we're going to see just how quick and easy it is to set up an adjustable rear view mirror. We're in our brand new car, and we're going to take this mirror model and set it up so our player can grab it with their right hand and rotate it left and right. This is all done without any extra animations on our model. The IK system handles all of it. First, we'll create a folder to hold our components and a subfolder for the mirror model. Next, we want to add the analog rotator component. This will tell our mirror which way to rotate. Put the model in the hinge field, set the rotation speed, and we want to rotate on the y-axis. Next, we need to add some input components, so that the player can control the mirror's rotation in the game. Let's add a button input component, and set it to use our left mouse button. This will make it rotate to the left. We can clone this game object and set it to use the right mouse button to rotate the mirror to the right. We also want the player's hand to reach out and grab the mirror when they look at it. We do this by adding a self-input component. Set this to use the right hand. Now we have to set the position of where the player's hand should grab. The easiest way to do this is by using this holographic hand prefab. Let's rotate it into position. Just here looks good. Once in position, we can remove the holographic model from the transform object. Now drag the transform into our input components. And finally, we need to make this entire thing interactive. So let's add an interactive trigger. Fill out the user interface instructions and icons. These will guide the player. Lastly, drag our three inputs into the interactive trigger. And we're done. Let's press play and see it in action. If we look at the mirror, our right hand reaches out and grabs the mirror. If we look away, the hand returns to the steering wheel. If we press our mouse buttons while looking at the mirror, we can rotate the mirror to any position we like. And that's how easy it is. For detailed tutorials, visit the Clean Shirt Labs YouTube channel.